Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I want to show you how to download uh, files from the History Lover Sims blog at historicalsimslive.blogspot.com. Um, the site makes heavy use of Clicksha and also Sims File Share. Clicksha is, or it has lots of ads and clickbait. Um, unfortunately, the, the first few times I tried this, I ended up with malware, adware on my computer, um, but through trial and error, I figured out how to download from the site. Um, so I wanted to show everyone else so that you could get this gorgeous custom content, um, historical custom content for your game without um, the headache that I went through. So first, a couple of things. I am using Firefox. And also I have Adblock installed. You can download that for free. Just uh, Google it. Um, so when you find a file that you're ready to download, you just click on the picture on the site and then scroll down to where it says um, download. Um, click that download button and then you will be taking to, taken to the Clickshare site. I usually get this notice which says, will you allow the OKO.sh to send notifications? So I just press not now. Um, and then there are several buttons on this page. Don't click on anything that says download. Um, the only thing on this particular page that you should click on is right here where it says, I'm not a robot. So if you click there, you may get a pop-up um, in another window. Um, if you get the CAPTCHA pop-up, pop you can go ahead and solve it, but if you get another um, tab opening up, go ahead and close it. Um, it's just an ad or it's taking you to a, um, a sponsor site. And just keep clicking, I'm not a robot, and closing out anything, no matter what it says, even if it says, you know, uh, your file is ready, especially if it says .exe, don't open anything like that. And you may have to do this several times um, until you get this little check mark by I'm not a robot, and then you can click continue. And when I click continue, it takes me to this page where I get a 15 second countdown. Um, you do have to wait the 15 seconds. You can't go over to a new tab, browse the news headlines while you're waiting because when you come back, it will start the countdown where you left off. So when you get down to zero seconds, click on get link below that. Um, don't click on any of these other things. Just click on get link. Um, and then sometimes you will get the... Um, the download option, um, which will have the file name TS4 underscore and then whatever the name of the file. And um, as far as I can tell, all or most of her files in with hsl.zip. So you can go ahead and, and uh, click OK to save that file. Um, sometimes you will, uh, when you click get link, it will take you to Sims file share. Let me see if I can find a quick example. And here I speed up the video so you don't have to watch me go through this whole process again. And this is what it looks like when you're taken to Sims File Share. Um, sometimes there are other ads on the page, um, but uh, for this one, you just want to make sure you're clicking on the download button that's right below the file name and you save files, save the file as you would normally do. Um, and that's it. That's all there is to it. I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, hit the like button. If you'd like to see more, hit subscribe.